What's up guys, Ian Greer, eventbeats.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how I make El Isostre melodies. So I'm just going to get right into it. I already have some sounds here. So I like to start off by just making the root note of the beat I'm going to be making. And so I'll usually just start off with something like this. I don't like to go below A because most 808s, like the 808s I use, don't sound good below, um, don't sound good below A. So I'm going to set up the root note so that I don't have to change my melody later or change my chords so the the trick to doing this what makes it so easy is when you're making your chords you can just skip the next note in the scale and then go to the next one and then you're just going to do that again and then that's so we're just going to build out our chords like that it's pretty simple So there we go, then I'm just going to repeat that. And then I'm actually just going to copy that onto the next pad sound. I'm going to solo that. So this one's kind of like a bell pad. So I want to strum this. So I'm going to go to none. And then I'm just going to drag these out a little bit. Just makes it sound a little more human, like someone's actually playing it. So now I'm just going to go to this flute sound and just click in a, a, just click in some notes for this to play. Then I'm actually going to copy that and this guitar is just going to play the same notes. Then I'm going to go to this bell sound and I'm gonna go to this bell sound and just make simple melody. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Now I'm just going to see how everything sounds together. Yeah. 